It's holiday season and everyone's making plans to travel. Booking flights, bus tickets, planning road trips by car or on motorcycles. Speaking of motorcycles, motorcyclists are constantly exposed to risk. What keeps their heads safe? Helmets do. What doesn't? Watch. Bro. Are you going there? On down there. You be there. Don't be that guy. Reckless riding doesn't guarantee anyone's safety. But whose job is it to guarantee a helmet safe? We meet the professional helmet testers at Sirim. Finding the professional helmet testers were a challenge. And just when I was ready to give up, help arrives. It's showtime with Brother Helmet. Brother Helmet, I finally meet you. So tell me, who are you and what do you do here? Hi, selamat datang. Saya Tasrif. Saya adalah ketua makmal uh, pengujian helmet dan visor. So helmet dari seluruh Malaysia datang ke sini. Yeah, betul. Oh, yeah. So, how do we test these helmets? Berapa proses yang ada untuk pengatuan uh, pengapa? Pengetahuan. Pengetahuan. Yeah, okay. betul. Helmet yang masuk ke yang perlu mendapatkan uh, label sini perlu menjalankan pengujian. Okay. Kerana dia adalah barang mandatori okay. di bawah kita JPJ. Okay. Pertama kita akan uh, menjalankan uh, general and verification testing. Can I see that? Ya. Yeah. Kita boleh tengok sebenarnya. Ya yeah, mana? Uh, kita tengok dulu untuk general and verification testing. Okay. Every helmet on Malaysian roads gets tested here in Sirim. But is there a human head willing to volunteer testing them all? Turns out. They have dummies in different sizes for the job. Size 60 tadi adalah untuk size 60 cm lilitan kepala. Okey. Okey, dan di dalam almari tersebut kita ada size 50 Ui. sampai 62 cm. Dia punya syarat utama shell helmet tadi itu shell helmet. Ya, shell helmet. Okay. Yang keras, yang keras eh. Perlu menutupi bahagian sini. Okey. Minimum kalau, area. Ka, if, if, kalau tak tutup, kalau tak tutup design awal-awal kita reject. So after the dummies, we are back to the helmets. Intense. So Brother Helmet and team conduct helmet safety with a free fall test. But what about unexpected objects falling on our heads? This is the penetration test. Did we get that? Ini salah satu contoh bila oh. kata sampel ni fail untuk penetration test. Kita akan menilai berdasarkan pada headphone tadi. Kalau striker itu tidak menembusi, maknanya dia okey. So, ini pas lah. Pas. Kalau saya nak try untuk test satu lagi barang, boleh tak? Apa barang dia? Saya tunjukkan sekarang. Kenapa? <laughs> Sincer, Aman? Kerana ini adalah sama saiz dengan kepala manusia. Saya dah tengok apa beza dia. Impak yang ada di atas ini. Okay, let's be real. The coconut doesn't simulate my beautiful bald head. But I was thirsty. Kalau kita tengok ni, cuba kita gambarkan ini adalah kepala. 4.5 kilo berat, ketinggian 2 meter jatuh ke atas kepala. Dan mensemburkan ke semua air kelapa. Semua sembur keluar kan? Kita keluar habis. Semua dah habis ke? Tengok. Ada sikit lagi. Ada sikit lagi. Oh, mana yang minum? Ah, tak apa, terima kasih. Uh, sorry. Uh, ini kawasan mak mahal. Saya minta maaf, tak boleh minum. Oh, okay. Helmet tutup kepala, visor tutup muka. Betul. Correct. Betul. Okay. So macam mana kita nak tengok testing ni? Okey, untuk pengujian visor ni kita akan menggunakan berbola besi oh, okay. untuk menggambarkan seolah batu-batu yang terbang sebab tu oh. kita menunggang motosikal. Saya akan tunjukkan uh, menggunakan alat pengujian yang ada. Jom, okay. saya tunjukkan. Actually, I have a question as well. So when you put all these things together, how are you impacted? Right? And there you have it. The everyday life of a professional helmet tester, keeping our heads safe on the road. Thank you, Brother Helmet. Okay, welcome. Thank you for showing me around all the different tests that you okay, have sama. for the helmet today. Okay. I appreciate it very much. Okay. All the best to you. Diharapkan banyak belajar. Yes, thank you. Okay, welcome. So, what other strange jobs can the Malaysian workforce have to offer? I guess we'll find out soon enough. <laughs>